I chose Falmouth for a lot of reasons. My main thing was the university and the course. Like that's that was always priority number one. But like location wise, Falmouth is a beautiful place to live. It's really calm, it's really nice. So we've got loads and loads of festivals going on all the time. There's always events and hubbub and things like that. Um, I chose this university because when I was looking at other ones, the course here seemed a lot better. There was a lot more practical stuff to do. The lecturers seemed really nice when we came for open days. Well, our course covers um, four things. So basically it is lighting, um, sound, it is stage management, and then set building rigging. The atmosphere in Amart is really creative. Stores incredible incredible resource um absolutely fantastic they've got so much cutting edge equipment there it's like a library but for technical equipment like it's a real big draw for falmouth they do they do that very very well they do it right everything is all in this massive community and this almost like the Amata is weird to think of it as a building it's almost like a little town or city of its own where it just you can walk around and you can have lunch with a band and then on your way on your way out you'll then start talking to a to a group of actors who are putting on a show and they'll want you for that and then they, you know the next people will want you for that it's constantly on the go it's great i love it what's really interesting is that all of the tutors that i have are all industry professionals who became tutors that's kind of the whole ethos behind the tech course is it's a tech course taught by tech people about tech good thing about our tutor groups is they're quite small so we get a lot of one-on-one -on -one teaching um, with our lecturers so if you've got any problems you can go and ask them and they'll spend more time with you as they would if you're in a bigger group yeah they're really hard working and really really good the facilities here really are top of the line yeah because a lot of places they're still running old stuff but here they bring the new stuff so that when you go out into the future there's you're working with what you will be working with later and you learn the more advanced stuff anyway i'm having great fun on this course it's it's really hands-on and I really like that. Friday we've got a lunchtime gig. It's a good opportunity because lectures get you actually, when you're first year, go and work on it. So like do lighting, if you're interested in lighting, if you're interested in sound, do sound. And that, that basically gave me so much experience. The whole ethos of the course is hands-on learning on the job. And if you can learn on a real job, then they will let you do that. It's exactly what I want to be doing. So the Amata is obviously laid out into lots of different studios and each studio is treated like an independent venue, which is amazing because it's like you walk in and it's basically just like a street of different venues and each one has their own creative standards and creative rigs and all the rest of it. I really get the sense that I'll leave here knowing what to expect on a professional level show. It covers everything you need to know in technical theatre in a really good, fun way.